right, we're not getting out enough. We've uh, we decided to have a day out. So we haven't done this for absolutely ages. And we're going to a place called Rivington Terrace. It's, it's uh, near Bolton. It's actually in Chorley, but it's near Bolton. So we're just gonna head in across country and uh, we're gonna see what it's like. So uh, why don't you come along with us? The other thing is we've got a couple of things I wanted to share with you. Um, main thing is about the annex, isn't it? You better tell them, Jen. The bay window. So the bay yeah, window, yeah. you keep yeah. calling it the annex. We've yeah. got a bay window at the side of the house and it's been nothing but a pain leaking, hasn't it? Yeah. Leaking from the roof bit. Um, so we've, we've had the builders during the first two years looking at it. We had, we had a period where it didn't seem to be a problem and then suddenly last year it got worse again didn't it yeah pouring in down the side so I had a local firm come and they repointed the bricks above and that seemed to do it for a bit so we thought fine it's finally fixed so we got some new window blinds and when we came when we came to look last week on Friday what did you see more leaks it's yeah. driving me nuts so we'd we'd spent i don't know 600 pounds on new blinds no uh, on that on the blinds uh, it was 650 to repair the point the thing yeah we that. spent a couple of hundred on the blinds didn't we yeah yeah and the blinds are all stained as well now yeah so <laughs> if we're not been making as many videos as as usual that's probably why because we've been absolutely fed up with that <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> so we're having a big argument with NHBC, the uh, house guarantee um, people. Yes. And uh, they they told us they wanted us, us to paint the roof. I think I'll put a picture in here. The roof is a GRP um, red plastic thing. And they want and the, our builders turned up and they've got some stuff that they said to use a gripple, I think it's called. And uh, it. It was grey. Yeah. It's grey. So they said, "Are you sure we want you want us to do this?" And I said, "Actually, no, I'm not." No. No, so, it, it was keeping me awake the night the night before they were coming because I thought grey on that roof that's supposed to be red would just look horrible. Yeah. So that's sort of been ongoing, isn't it? So what else have we been doing? <laughs> We've been on a diet. <laughs> yeah. We're on a. Well, we're on a. A meal plan, aren't we? Yeah, We're, since I went to that um, pre-diabetic clinic, uh, you picked up the book that they gave me and you said, oh, yeah. there's a meal plan in here. Yeah. So we've been following that. So I've lost, I think I've lost two kilograms. I've lost one and a half. Yeah, Yeah. so that's not bad. I'm a bit hungry at the moment. I know. I confess. <laughs> Looking forward to your whole meal bread sandwich, aren't you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the main thing is cutting out the bread, isn't it? Yeah, it's the white bread. Yeah. Yeah. So anyway, I thought we'd share that with you. And yeah. uh, I think we'll catch you as we approach this uh, Rivington Terrace. OK. So we're on the M61, aren't we, going south? And that's yeah. Rivington Services. Famous Great Manchester of Clean Air Zone. It's not coming to force, is it? No. Still under review. Stadium. Yep. At the roundabout, take the second exit to the Havilland Way. Oops, Bolton's ground, isn't it? It is Bolton's ground, then. It is, yeah. Oh, it's quite impressive, isn't it? It is. Remember them when they were. League the, One, you mean? League One. Yeah, League One. Turn right. 
gate on the driving lane. Not sure if they're going to give way there. I know. Weird junction, isn't it? Yeah. Not up there, no. no. Right, on to driving. Like here. Yeah, it's here, isn't it? Oh, this looks interesting. In half a mile, turn right on to Little Park This is getting narrower. Big thing. Epic pothole, eh? What, like another moto? Yeah, or a big truck or a tractor or something big. Turn right onto Lever Park Avenue, then take the first left. What's this up here? Oh, that's a school. Turning right here and then left, aren't they? I think so. Yeah. Can you look that way? Yeah, there's nobody. And then here? Or up there? Up there, I would have said. Not in there. We're not. No. Hmm. I think it was up there. It's horrible. Yeah. Yeah, it was up there. It really was, it was muddy and Ow. narrow. for it, are they? No. Well, there are some brown signs here. Oh, yeah. Turn right onto Royton Road. So it's this here. Yeah, I know. I'm just reading what the sign says up there. So Great not... House Barn Information Centre, one mile. And that's straight on. So I don't like the look of that. No, we're not going up there. Might have gone in the out, but not in the van. We'll go this way and see if it brings us out onto anything. Turn right. No, it's just turning us round. Then yeah. The first left. Have a look on Google Maps in a minute. We'll just pull over here. I mean, there's no signs telling you to go up there. No, no. This says Rivington here. Yeah. Just wait here. Yeah, we decided to come a little bit further up, didn't we, to see if we can find Yeah, it. I mean, we can't get up that road in the van. It's uh, from walk up it, but it's 25 minutes walk. Was it 25 minutes? Yeah, seven minutes was if you were in a vehicle. Oh. Yeah, and then you've got sort of steps and things, haven't you, after that. It's probably if you brought your bike, you could have uh, oh, yeah, cycled could, up there. Could have done, yeah. Well, something, there's a lake here, isn't there? There's a lake there, yeah. Yeah. Maybe we can park somewhere along here. Yeah, this is the 
great house barn. Like a tea room, I think. Roger. Remington Hall barn there. Do we go in here? Oh, oh. I can't. I can't see where to go. I'm pestered by cars behind me as well. Yeah. I think that was to, you see, it's like a tea room. Yeah. So I think that was the car park for that. Okay. Stopping here could endanger a child's life. Well, if you're on the keep, left, keep clear of it. Going down towards the lake here. Yeah. In three quarters of a mile, turn left onto New Road. Try to turn us around, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, this looks good. Here, well, there's some parking down there, isn't there? Is there? On along the along the thing. Yeah, causeway. My jet's double yellow lines there. Yeah. Okay. Might be somewhere further up the hill. Or further along. Hi, right, it's the reservoir. Oh, go on, girls. It's obviously a very popular spot. Yes, isn't it? There's people everywhere. Oh. Two doggies have had their hair cut yesterday, didn't they? Yeah. I'm trying to keep them clean as possible. Not come out of there. Way, T. T, go come on. on. Go on. Go on. Yeah, Tara's going home tomorrow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> For four nights, am I? Yeah. That's it, Monday, wasn't it, she came? Yeah. Come on. Poppy's bottom's a bit bare, isn't it? Yes. <laughs> but yeah, this is very pleasant. It's a trifle on the chilly side today, but... Uh, yeah, we put spring coats on, didn't we? put spring jacket on. <laughs> so I think we'll be all right if we keep moving. Little pond down there. I'm just studying the map here. There's quite a bit, bit to see here. There's lead mines, and there's obviously a memorial for a Wellington bomber crash. The two uh, things you can see at the top of the hill is the Pigeon Tower and Rivington Pike. And then you've got a Liverpool Castle. There's a Go Ape, which is probably all that noise. That's what the hear. noise is, yeah. Yeah. Uh, and it, it says there's eight reservoirs here, eight different reservoirs. There's upper. Lower. <laughs> Just wait for his car to go past. Upper Rivington and Lower Rivington, Yarrow Reservoir and Angles Arc Reservoir, all built at different times. And they all run down the valley. So how many litres of water do you reckon they all hold? I don't know, it says there somewhere, doesn't it? Yeah, eight hundred and... 18,000 million litres of water. 18,000 million? Are you sure 18... about it? <laughs> 18... Where is How do you read that? 18,000 million, million litres of water. Yeah, okay. that's what I said. So that's 18 billion litres of water. Yeah, and it says that's enough to give every home in the world a bucket, bucket full. Bucket wow. <laughs> yeah, so that's the lower reservoir. Uh, in the sun there is the upper reservoir. We just parked along the side here. Blue green algae, so no swimming. Yeah, just here, puppy. This is our van, isn't it? There is a there is a campsite just up here. Top of this uh, embankment thing. 
Let's have a look. Yeah, so there's the road down to the reservoir. And just up here, I think, is the campsite. So let's have a quick look. Yeah, there's a brewery and tap room. Yeah, Rivington Brewing Company. Um, 12 to 8 p.m. Street food. There's a little campsite here as well. Yeah, so a little campsite here. That's very nice. Side of the reservoir. Yeah, that's all right. Nice views there. Very nice. And this looks like the uh, tap room. Okay, that's handy, isn't it? How good is that? Oh yeah, definitely have to give this a go. I think. reservoir and the pike in the distance just the bit on the top of the hill there oh yeah very good looks like there's a toilet uh, hut there shower room maybe don't know we'll have to find out there's barbecue points over there somewhere to sit in the or somewhere to shelter anyway yeah Got all lights up. That looks all right. So this is the campsite, isn't it, on our left yeah. here? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, looks good. That might have to give that a go. Towards Chorley. The other reservoir, isn't it? Yew Tree Inn up there. Is what? Something called Yew Tree Inn. Another pub here. So you could walk to this one. The Bay Horse. Yeah. Oh, yeah, looks good here, doesn't it? Yeah, walkers, dogs, bikers, and muddy boots. Yeah. Southport. All right, we're heading back now to Southport. A nice little trip out, haven't we? It's been good. Yes, it's been interesting. At the roundabout, take the second exit to Southport New Road. I don't think we need uh, any we know more, do we I think we know what they are. <laughs> Yeah. Well, it's been an interesting afternoon, isn't it? We'll have to go and stay at that campsite. It yeah, good. We'll, we can explore Rivington a bit more then, can't we? That's right. Just just thought, I didn't realise there was that much there. I just thought there was some these gardens which uh, seem to be way up in the, um, in the hills. Um, and the reservoir. So this seems oh, oh. this road. This road is really bad. But yeah, there's certainly a lot more there and that campsite looks interesting. So uh, perhaps we'll make a trip there at some stage. We've got the sunny spot then, T. Eh? Yeah, we stopped at the uh, RSPB centre or car park on the coast road in Southport. Very nice it is too. Bob's got her eye on something. What you got your eye on? I think I like the mess of this net. Unfortunately the net seems to survive. Yeah, Poppy's got to look out the window, so. <laughs> Tara's driving home. Yeah. Yeah, so uh one thing I wanted to say, and I was trying to say it going along that <laughs> bumpy blooming road and every time it hit a bump I couldn't think what I was going to say. One thing I wanted to say we had a bit of a problem with the VW up. It uh, Every time we went over a speed, well it's still doing it, every time we 
went over a speed hump, it goes ee 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 ee. Yes, we thought. Oh, sorry, Poppy. Sorry. She doesn't like that noise. Doesn't like that noise. No, we're all right. It's okay. <laughs> yeah, you thought you were in the up for a minute, didn't you? <laughs> yeah. So, uh, so I took it to Southport MOT uh, garage, a place I often go uh, when I want some work done on the car and the van. Oh, and come on. All right. Don't need. I don't need a face wash. Go on, Poppy. And. Uh, I took, I took it there and I explained what was going on and they got it up on the ramp and they checked the suspension they got the old uh, crowbar out and lever the suspension about and checked uh, checked nothing was moving nothing was loose or generally the suspension was working I wondered if my shock absorbers had, were going he said no they're fine he said what happens is that sometimes as cars get older the, uh, the rubber bushes in the suspension um, it, the rubber gets a bit um, or did he say um, a bit dry, dry a bit dry, dry. and uh, that's what's causing the squeaking it's the bushes are dry he said he could change it but uh, it, if it's not if they're not gone or you know they're not going then it's not worth it he said it would be about eight or nine hundred pounds to change all the bu all the suspension bushes so I could see Jenny's face well this was on the same day that the builders came and said roughly how much all that pointing <laughs> on the wall would <laughs> cost right. so uh, if, I mean, it has to be done. It has to be yeah. done. It's got, it has to go for its MOT, doesn't it? Yeah. In July. Yeah. So if there's anything wrong with the suspension, obviously we'll, we'll know about it's, it. It's but nine years old. Is it nine now? It'll I think so. Well, it yeah. would be. We've got 2015, wouldn't we? Yeah, I know. So, so yeah. July 2015, because yeah. we, we came back um, past where we borrowed the trailer from, didn't we? Barlow Trailers. Oh, that's right, yeah. yeah um, when we took it to um, Tower Frame to get yeah. the a-frame fitted yeah. so that was about august 2015 oh yeah yeah so it, so yeah it's, it's not a young car is it no we're unwilling to change it really because it's uh, it's got all the uh, the tow frame yeah fittings on i know it. i know well yeah. that's what what we've been thinking as long as we want to yeah tow something and it's uh, okay it's just it started this this squeak and i thought mm. yeah but, well, i suppose uh, you're going to experience that as cars get older so yeah yeah something you've just got to live with really well, put the music up a bit. I mean, <laughs> yeah, you said turn the radio up. Yeah. It, you were, he did say that you'll, you'll notice some problem perhaps with steering or whatever if it's... If it starts to and go. And then we'll, we'll have to well, get Well, I mean, if down. the bushes at the back start to go, it, it starts steering from the back. So, you know, you, mm. you know something's wrong then. But yes. it, it drives fine. He took it for a drive and, he, you know, checked it was steering all right. And he said, no, it, it seems to be all right. I, he said, I'd, I'd let you know if there was a, a problem. So isn't it good that when people... Uh, mm. You you think you've got a problem? Don't just say you've got a problem. You've and got a problem, be, and, you're, and yeah. it'll cost you X Y Z. Well, you know? I was quite grateful to those um, two builders that came around and yeah. said, you know, really, if you if you really want a grey roof, we'll do it. Uh, we'll do it. But, <laughs> but, um, but are you sure? Are you sure? And I yeah. just thought, no. Yeah, there I mean, needs to be more people like that. Mm. You know, it's uh, I think it's far too much people telling you to do something when you don't need to do it. Yeah, you know, uh, that's right. Yeah, yeah. So, so, I think so that's that's it for. I don't know when this video is going out. When is it know. going out, Poppy? Probably, I don't know, perhaps sometime. 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 Sometime before we go to Harrogate. Yeah, yeah. possibly. Yeah, right. Might, yeah, we might do it. Put it out on the Tuesday or the Monday, maybe. Yeah. yeah. So we're off to Harrogate on the wet next Wednesday. Next Wednesday. It's what Thursday today. Yes. Yeah, Thursday today. Yeah. Thursday today. Yeah, we've got another video out on. Well, they'll have seen that one now. I don't know why I get into all of this. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I know that you really confuse yourself. Yeah. Yeah, so no, this will be going out before we go to Harrogate, yeah. won't it? Yeah, it might not be going out at all, I don't know. No, we might not, re it might not have recorded anything. It <laughs> might just be black screen or something. Yeah, I had, I had big plans for today, but uh, we really didn't fancy walking up that big hill in the mud. No, and I no. really didn't fancy taking the van up there. No. I'm not sure there was anywhere to park once you got up there anyway. No, there was no signs or anything, was there? No, so... Anyway. So, so that, anyway, Rivington itself was interesting. Yeah. Um, I like the reservoir there, I like the campsite, so maybe we'll go back there and spend Stay a bit more time. Stay at the campsite, time. then we, can, we yeah. don't have to worry about parking the van, do no, we? No, and I could hike up the hill as well. You could, yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, so on that note, I think we're going to leave it. You say bye then, Poppy? No? Okay. Right. <laughs> Tara's still just in her seat, ready to drive back, aren't you? <laughs> yeah. So we'll see you soon. Yeah. Bye, Bye then. then.